Heightened rhetoric and emotions ahead of the November 8th midterm elections are behind Bear County's increased emphasis on election security, keeping both voters and election workers safe. And just as county commissioners were talking about this very issue, word came that someone overnight shot out a window with the local Democratic Party headquarters. Jesse Degollado says, as it turns out, that wasn't the only storefront hit at a retail center along Fredericksburg Road. The surveillance video shows a vehicle slowing down and a shot fired at a front window, the impact shattering the double-paned window at the Jimenez Panaderia and coffee shop. Next door, the damage was much the same at the Bear County Democratic Party headquarters. Its window had been shot out as well. But there was only a small hole in the window of a campaign headquarters on the other side of the Panaderia. But since the Bear County Democratic Party window wasn't the only one shot at, there was this one and another one down the way. Was it the primary target or just one of three? His campaign office on the end may have sustained the least damage, but Joe Gonzalez says he was speaking out as a district attorney in defense of Bear County Democrats. I am deeply disturbed by this act of political violence. And then again, pending the investigation. It could be pure random acts of violence, and that's certainly possible. And certainly more than a coincidence, says the Bear County Democratic Chair, finding what she called unpleasant messages and her volunteers being harassed and followed. The party has seen uh, this type of act, not to this extent. There were gunshots at the Democratic headquarters last night. I, I mean, this is real. To Jackie Kellanen especially, given the threats and intimidation she says have targeted her and her election staff, if they have now crossed the line and broken the law, says Sheriff Javier Salazar. That's not something we'll allow. Jesse Degollado, KSAT 12 News.